So in any MLB, the one thing that everybody wants to do, hit a home run. It doesn't matter if you're a veteran, if you're brand new to the game, or just trialing it on the Game Pass from Xbox. The main thing that everybody wants to do is hit a home run. So how do you do it? Are you struggling? Let's go through the basics, and I'll show you some on the screen so you can see the kind of when I'm hitting it, when I'm kind of going for the shot, if I'm early, if I'm very early, or late, or perfect timing. We'll kind of go through a set of actual home runs. So the first things first, whenever I kind of go through the home run videos, is it is all about timing. That That is the understatement of the year is timing is absolutely everything for this. You don't have to be perfect all the time. You don't always have to hit power. You can hit a normal shot. You can hit power. Both will get the same results in terms of actually being able to hit a home run. So the way I personally do it from a very very bog standard sort of perspective because by no means am I a veteran of this game. I like it every year. I give it a go. I don't play it year in, year out. I kind of give it a little bit of a go and then I'll kind of move on to another game. So this is from a complete bog standard perspective and the biggest tip I could give anybody is wait. The big thing that I struggled with at the very start of any baseball game and to be honest even the start of this game as well as because I don't immerse myself every single day in the game is I find myself twitching that little bit before. I'm seeing the ball come in, I'm thinking, you know what, I can swing and it's almost like I'm feeling the swing go. When you press the button to swing the bat, it is like instant. So you've always got to give yourself that second. Normally what I do is if I'm ready to hit the button, take one step and then hit. Don't try and go and, and kind of launch yourself at it because you've got to let the ball come to you. Like I said, you don't always have to have perfect timing. It can be done on very early at times and it can be done on early and slightly late as well. You can get a home run from all of them. And as you'll see throughout the clips, it isn't necessarily the perfect every time. And to be honest, sometimes it is just a generic hit. It isn't anybody absolutely fantastic. And the biggest thing as well to kind of get your practice in, because that's what this is going to take. Personally, for me, the biggest tip I would, I would imagine is just wait and then go into a practice mode. Go into an exhibition, put everything on basic, hitting, pitching, put all the difficulties on basic to start with and work your way up. You'll find yourself to start with if you're on the pitching beginner is that they will throw easier balls. And a good way of doing this is putting the difficulty to dynamic. It will increase as it knows how better you are getting as such. So you'll find yourself maybe a curveball isn't quite going your way. You may be trying to, to kind of go for every shot the exact same and sometimes it works definitely on the beginner the rookie levels it will work like that but as you progress into a more an advanced difficulty you've got to then change it up a little bit you've got to watch what they're actually doing are they going high on the pitch are they going low and you've got to react accordingly but i'm just talking for the absolute basic and i think for me if i was giving you one tip is the weight the weight is absolutely perfect last year i did the same and i feel like there was quite a good response obviously if you are more veteran into the game it's pretty bog standard advice i'm not saying this is going to be a guaranteed home run every time it's not going to absolutely change the lives of people that play this day in day out because that's not how the channels run and how i personally run on this game i'm very bog standard not necessarily newbie because i have played the game for a fair few years now and i must admit it is pretty cool that it is on the game pass so i don't actually have to pay for it and i can give it a lot more of my time rather than maybe not necessarily be my sport going into it but let me know if it helps and i'll hopefully get a more of an improved in-depth guide coming very soon